Hi everyone, this is Austin from Raw Bliss. Uh, I hope everybody had a great holiday, had a great Christmas. Um, I spent mine with my mom and grandma and it was absolutely amazing. Just exchanging gifts, listening to music, enjoying some nice holiday movies. And it was just a great time, you know, enjoying some good food. I bought, I brought like a fruit platter with like some persimmons and opal apples and mandarins and brought some avocado, some kiwi, and it was a really, really good time. I hope you guys had a great holiday. But today, um, oh yeah, I want to show off my shirt too. I got for Christmas. Here today, guac tomorrow. <laughs> oh, I love it. My mom got it for me. And um, Kevin Schneed, once again, shout out his Facebook. Um, he makes these beautiful wire wraps that I got recently. Uh, this one's a mushroom tourmaline with a copper wrapping on it. I love it so much. I got this one for $75. Amazing deal. He does all this handwork. Oh my goodness, it's amazing. So today I wanted to do the avocado challenge. I have here um, how many do I have? Twenty-four small avocados. These are these are pretty small. You know, the teeny tiny ones from Trader Joe's. If you got them, you know they're like three dollars for a six pack. You know, so I'm just gonna get right into this. <laughs> I want to see how many I can get. Um, they were all really ripe, so. I thought it would be a great time to do this. Hopefully they're all really nice, like this one. Also got some water here. I recommend anybody who's eating a lot of avocados, drink some water. Drink a lot of water. Any food that's not like 70, 80% water, definitely want to drink some along with your meal, not after your meal. Um, it's not going to be as good but with your meal, before your meal. Mm -hmm. I love avocados. And right now it's winter time. And avocados are gonna help me put on some some healthy weight. That's one down. I guess I'll eat these a little differently. This one I'll just I'll move my water. I'll just eat some with my hands, and I'll peel some, and I'll eat some with my fingers, and you know, all sorts of ways. These are really nice avocados. It's my favorite way to eat an avocado right there. I might just eat all of them like this. down to the seed. That's how you do it. Thing about peeling them is it's kind of just hit or miss because you don't know if they're going to be good, if they're going to be bad. Just kind of got to go with it. If you see like a little brown spot, you know, it's like, oh no. It's a bad one, but so far so good. You know. Mm. So far, 
are so good. cut this one because why not so today all I really had was about a half a gallon of orange juice for breakfast after that oh and that was about around about 2 p.m. which I drank that and that was breaking my dry fast. From seven the last night, so it was really nice. Probably one of my favorite ways to break a dry fast. And then all I really had other than that was three mandarins. And that was like three hours ago. It's about 6.20 right now, you know. It's been about two weeks now since I quit the drugs, all the drugs, completely sober now. I was on the vaporizing of THC extract, or dabs, or wax, whatever you want to call it. These avocados are beautiful. Just wanted to say that. And I feel amazing. So glad I did it. Uh, my skin is getting a lot better. I have a feeling that's one of the biggest factors in me having acne my whole life. Well, most of my life, you know. Since I was, you know, a freshman in high school. 13, 14 years old, been struggling with it. But you know, it's finally cleared up. Mm. When there's nothing you can put on your face, it's gonna help you with acne. Maybe some fruit, you know? I'll put some avocado on my face. Mm -hmm. But it's all about what's on the inside. It's about what you eat. It's about staying hydrated. So obviously, it's not something I would do often. 
I don't just eat avocados like crazy every single day. But I was kind of curious to see how many I can eat because I've been eating like a lot the past um, past few weeks since I've been since I came off my juice fast. Because they digest so much better now. It's like I have a newfound appreciation for them. Especially when the bacon avocados come. Oh wow, those things are the best. If you ever get a chance to try bacon avocados, try them. No, they don't taste like bacon. They were made by a guy named Bacon though. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Oh, drop that one. That's okay. I talked to this guy today. He was really convinced avocado was a vegetable. Mm. I had to enlighten him. avocados are a fruit. Anything with a seed is a fruit. Although there are things that are fruits that don't have seed. Which is completely ridiculous. Doesn't even make sense in this day and age. ate some skin by accident. It wasn't very good. Mm -hmm. Some of these are a lot harder to peel. Avocado kind of reminds me of durian, just because it's really fatty. And it, it kind of has a wide range of flavor. Not as wide as the durian, but mm. some are more buttery, some are more watery. rubs right into your skin. It's magic. You know what that means? That means it's easy to digest. Anything you can rub into your skin, it's easy to see. Easy to digest. <clears throat> oh, this one's so cute. Look at the tiny little seed. I love this. Wish that could be my thumbnail right there.
so I'm already getting pretty full. <laughs> it's a little harder than I thought. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is already well over a thousand calories from those nine avocados. Usually these smaller ones have about, I'd say 150 calories. Maybe less. Ooh, nice one too. They're so beautiful. They're so unique. like eating butter. Today was a really long day at work. I was just running all over the place. So it's nice to have a nice mm, just chill meal, sit down, relax, enjoy. The nice thing about avocados is they keep you full for a long time, like a long time. And the energy is more of a, a long lasting energy more than like a, <clears throat> like for like high carb fruit, like you get a really high energy for like, not a short time, but like a a good amount of time. Mm. Avocados are better for like long treks. Okay. Like if you're going hiking up a mountain, like a really arduous journey, especially in the cold, um, avocados are going to help you a lot. I've noticed when doing certain breathing methods and um, being out in the cold, it just doesn't affect you as much, you know? It's really interesting. Come on, it's number 11. Yeah, yeah. I haven't even got a bad one yet. It's so cool. I like how Trader Joe's always has ripe avocados. I don't think I've ever had a problem. Maybe like once.
much else to say, but yum. Yum. Okay, you know what? <clears throat> I'm gonna do one more. If I can find a really good one. This one looks really good. Final one. I'm just gonna peel it off. Let's go for it. Yes. Yes. Go all the way. Peel it all the way. All the way. Look at that. I love when that happens. Mm. That's a good looking avocado. Mm. There's probably some people watching this thinking I'm crazy. Like, dang, this guy really likes avocados. Like, he's got a shirt with avocados on it. He's eating, like, 20 avocados. Like, this guy's crazy. I just love fruit, man. That's about it for this um, avocado challenge. Let's see, how many do we have left here? Let's take, take this here. Um, one. Let's see. Three seeds. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. 11, 12. So yeah, that's it. 12 avocados. Oh, you guys didn't really think I'd eat 24 avocados, did you? No, no, no. But thank you guys so much once again for watching. Uh, I'm Austin from Rob List. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at roblist95. I post like all my meals on there as well as other pictures and quotes stuff like that so thank you guys once again make sure to eat raw and stay blissful and have a great new year i'll see you in the next one